here. Maybe this is our man. You a bounty hunter, mister? Maybe. It depends. Well, I'm guessing you ain't here to pass the day, turn yourself in, or discuss the finer points of county law. Then I don't need to know much more than that until I got a reason to. All right. You smell that? This here's a livestock town, mister. Tracks delinquents and reprobates like flies. Now, I'm not a fellow to pass a quick judgment, but I've been around long enough to know you don't hire a saint to catch a sinner. You bring me what I need, and I'll pay you well, and I won't ask no questions. So, what is it you need? Why don't you have a look at that poster on the wall over there? He's a low-down huckster. And poisoning folks with his miracle cure from here to Ansburg. Killed more than Landon Ricketts without even pulling a trigger. Get some kind of sick satisfaction out of it. The feller over at the saloon says he thought he saw him by the gorge straight north of here. You think you can bring him in? The money's good. I need him alive, though. I want to make sure the women he witted get compensated before he swings. I'll see what I can do. Well, good luck to you. And we need him alive. That's an important point. Alive, I got it. I ain't got nothing left but belly ache. Yeah. 
Throw it up. You Benedict Albright? Oh, sir? Huh. Kinda look like him. And I was told he'd be up here. No, uh, not me, sir. It's because I want to buy some medicine. And I heard him. I heard good things. I'll pay in gold. If you could help me find him. It's just... My mother's real sick. Oh! Well, if that's the case, if it's for a sick woman, I'd be happy to help. I'm a healer, you know? A medical man. Finest medicine in the state. <laughs> what? Game's over, mister. Put your hands up. I'm taking you in. Taking me in? What for? Apparently that stuff you're pushing is killing folk. There's a price on your head. I don't know. It ain't my business. Come on, partner. That's crap. I'm a healer. I got an aura. I speak to spirits. I'm a scientist. Folks get real angry for no good reason. This... this is a mistake. Keep your hands up, buddy. They only want you for questioning. I have to insist that this is a mistake. Don't be a fool. Hold on. I'm slipping. Shit. Oh, you saved me. Now, come on, buddy. Let's make this easy. What, you're taking me in? It's just for question. Oh, you saved my life. Ain't we had enough drama? I, I'd be better off jumping. I, they expressly told me not to kill you. Oh, this is about you. Don't jump. Or, or what? You can't shoot me. Oh. Please. I'll take my chance. Come here. Uh, bye, friend. Oh. Really do not like
Judge. I'm only in it for the money. That's even worse. I'm sure it does seem that way. <clears throat> All right. Let's take you in. Easy, easy. Suffering from exposure. Suffer a little longer. Oh. Oh. I seem to keep blacking out. Oh. Eh. You do seem to keep blacking out. isn't necessary. I'm a medical man, a healer. It's all just a big mistake. Oh, I don't feel very well. I told you to shut up. Well, who made you judge? <laughs> I'm only in it for the money. Mm. You don't understand anymore, and that's... Oh, my lord. I wasn't expecting you back so soon. Uh, Mrs. Calthorpe was, uh... Just leaving. Sure. Where you want them? I'm selling the back.
Oh, there's been some terrible mistake. I never did it. Any of it. I thought I told you to shut up, partner. But I told but you. But nothing. Shut up. And, uh, good luck. It's been real fun. You ain't much of a man. You ask folks for forgiveness, you remember this, partner. I've already forgotten. Now, sir, um, how much was you offered? Uh, $50. Here. Thank you. Madam. Uh, please, remember what I told you. Hey there, pal. Can you help me? Could you use some help finding my help? I've heard. Uh, Welcome back. Well, thanks, Annie. Mister. The things you see in the no, it's, uh, you. Yes, it is. Last time I checked. I, I really don't need any more trouble. I didn't come to make any. I was just protecting a lady. Well, all behind us now, I suppose. So what is it you need? A, a bath, perhaps? Can I be of any assistance in there? Nah, I'm all right, thanks. All right, suit yourself.
ugly bastard. You borrow from the O'Driscoll boys, you pay the O'Driscoll mm -hmm. boys. I made it right with you, I swear. Well, <laughs> hey, I guess you forgot about the interest. Quit this damn foolishness. What you staring at? Move along. Every one of us O'Driscoll's gonna piss on your grave. No, I don't want any of this at all. Don't believe it. Oh, hell, what's all this now? Yeah, no, this ain't for me. <clears throat> oh, come on, just trying to live my goddamn life. Search. 
try to remember what really happened at Sylvia's Saloon back in 76. Just a lot of bunk, Plato. It's just a lot of bunk. It's not bunk, Mr. Calloway, sir. It's history. Ancient history. Done and dusted. The dead got off lucky, the living got to keep Who's your shopping. friend there? Ha! Put that in your fucking book, Plato. This is Jim Boy Calloway. The Jim Boy Calloway.